everyone. Welcome to Librarians Learn. Today we have Pat with us and he's going to be teaching us how to tie a tie, which I'm really excited for. So um, let's see if uh, we can do it so we can look spiffy for the holiday season that's coming up. All right, let's go. Hey guys, the first knot I'm going to teach librarians is called the forehand knot, sometimes called the schoolboy knot. It's a very, very simple knot. First one I ever learned how to do. The nice thing about this is that you don't really need a mirror to do it, and it's very, very quick. Okay, I'm gonna learn how to tie a tie, I guess. <laughs> okay, I'm still pinching. And then open around like this. Under here. Yep. Oh, oh, I don't know if I can get it like tight, tight in my neck. Yep. Oh, she can't tie. Ta da! <coughs> Better. Yeah. All right. How's that? Good? That's good. That's hey. it. That's <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. I tied a tie. It's a very long time. Oh, man. That's shabby. <laughs> that was so good. That was bad. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to do the half Windsor now. Half Windsor is a symmetrical knot. It uses a bit more material, so we're going to use a little bit more material in this side. This is the thick side, also called the blade. So we're going to do a little more material in the blade. Ready? Half Windsor, here we go. Okay. Over to the side. <laughs> I don't <laughs> I'm interested somehow I think because it's not <laughs> good enough <laughs> through this way okay here, this way, this. Uh huh. Pull it through. That's a half wizard. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it. That's it. And look, you even got the length right. We nailed it. I'm good. Can I do it? You did it. I did yeah. it. I tried. <laughs> is that a good shape? That is. That's a good shape. Is it? Is it? Well done. That yeah. is a beautiful half wizard. And the final top knot we're going to learn is the full winter, but this tie is far too thick for the full winter, so I have to get a new tie for that one. All right, so now we're going to do the full winter. So for this one, we want a lot of material in the blade. Like I said, it's a very thick knot. It's a wide knot, so it's going to use a lot of material. So we're going to make this one quite short. All right. All right, so we're going to try the full winter. All right. Ready? Here we go. Oh, you, you make this look way better than what I just did, but I feel like I'm getting to the same point. Pick into your dominant side. And crossing behind. Um, this way. Yeah. Up and in. Up and in. Okay. Oh, I got pretty little triangle. I feel like I already did it this way. Did you do it the same way twice? We went behind the knot first time. Okay. This time we're going in front of the knot. Just back up. You got it. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know what happened. And then go ahead and tighten it up to your neck. Too tight. Too tight. Too tight. Okay. Yep. But there you go. Yeah, look at that. How's that? Shape. See? That's the full Windsor. All right. So, have I ever tied a tie? 
Yes, but I have absolutely no memory of it. Like I remember wearing ties for costumes, but don't know how I got to that point. I used to tie ties. Uh, yes, but not on me. Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think it's obvious? <laughs> I have tied a tie before. My dad taught me when I was younger. So I had some experience. Not a single one. Um, yes. Maybe, maybe once. And today was a, it was an experience. Uh, I, I don't know how I feel. It was an emotional roller coaster. There were some highs, there were some lows. I feel good now while I'm in the tie, looking spiffy. I think it's fun and I want to practice more. I think I need practice. I don't think this is right. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> these were fun and new, and I'm really glad to learn these. I can teach uh, my husband a thing or two now. <laughs> Wasn't too bad at it, but I'm really happy that I do not wear ties on a regular basis because this this would be a lot. I feel inspired, but I think I still prefer the clip-ons. <laughs> <laughs> or I'll just need to call it Patrick. <laughs>